welcome back to my channel excel online advisor and today we are going to discuss about top 5 excel new features that are going to release very soon so as of now in order to insert a row or a column what we generally do is we either use our mouse and press the insert command or some people use Control shift plus also to insert a column like this correct but you don't have to do it anymore because in order to insert a column between let's say E and F you just need to move your mouse top here in between both the columns now as soon as you see this plus icon you just need to click on it and bingo similarly if you need to insert a row between 5 and 6 just go here wait for this plus icon and click on it and bingo now the next feature that we are going to talk about is to unhide the data now in this sheet we have some hide data between c and f column and h and k column so in order to unhide we generally click on unhide like this and that's how we can unhide our data right but onwards what you need to do is you just need to go at the top of the two columns where your data is hiding and you will see an arrow going left and right and you just need to click on it and bingo again here in between h and k there is some data which is un which is hide actually it is saying click to unhide just click on it and bingo now freezing your rows and columns in excel that is something which i feel as a pain all the time because generally what we are supposed to do is we need to go to this freeze pane and then we can freeze our top row or the first column but you don't have to do it anymore like this what you need to do is just go here at the left of your sheet you will see here a horizontal and a vertical blue line now that's going to be the shortcut to freeze your sheet now let's suppose I want to freeze till column D so I need to look for this vertical line with the help of my mouse I'm going to drag it to column D and drop it by leaving the mouse and bingo now if I'm going to move the sheet you can see it's already freeze now the best part in order to unfreeze it just go back here wait for the blue line and drop it back to its original position and bingo it same goes with the rows look for the horizontal blue line drag it here and bingo similarly in order to undo it just throw back this blue line to its original position like this Next feature is to drop your elements or your column or your rows let's suppose I want to move this data after each column so what we have to do is I with the help of my mouse I selected the complete column and using control X now if I want to insert it after H I will go to I and then I will insert cut cells right okay now again you don't have to do it anymore now let's suppose I want to insert this wrap after total which mean I want to insert D column after G column so what I have to do is just take your mouse at the top of this you will see this hand icon correct now once you see this hand icon click your mouse drag it next to the column where you want to place it and bingo now that's how it's going to work in your excel very soon similarly it works for rows also now just wait for the hand icon and pin it here and bingo the next feature which we are going to talk about is to resize your rows and cells personally like i don't feel this is something very helpful but as of now in your sheet you if you need to like increase the size or decrease this you wait for this plus arrow and then you can change the sizes of your cells or your row or your column right but now onwards you need to look for this icon that's an arrow going left and right and once you see it using this you can increase and decrease the sizes of your row and column 
So these are the five new features that you're going to see in your Excel very soon. As of now, if you want to use it, you can use it online. Now, do let me know in comment section which one do you think you're going to use the most. And if you like the video, leave me a comment and share this with your friends. Thank you.